What up, y'all? It's your boy, AD on the track all day. I'm in the spot. I'm in the booth, chilling. I ain't got my cut right now because it's early, but <clears throat> I kind of wanted to talk about this last night. But I was like, all right, I'm going to talk about this now. You know what I'm saying? I got some other videos I want to do and ideas that I was thinking about doing for y'all that I'm probably going to do real soon. You know what I'm saying? Uh, just mainly about some TV shows. I'm going to talk about TV shows. I don't know what shows y'all like to watch. If y'all, you know, want me to comment about something, talk about something, leave it in the comments because y'all might be watching something that I'm talking about. So let's see. Anyways, LeBron James, man, opting out of his contract or whatever, you know what I'm saying? Basically finna become a free agent July 1st, 2015, very soon, which is pretty much in a couple days. And it's like, basically, it's like, what the hell is this? You know what I'm saying? You know, basketball season over. They just got to get your attention some way, somehow. They got to keep people att attracted to this shit. You know what I'm saying? Just like, It's like, damn, it's always some shit with Le LeBron James. It's like, every time this nigga become a free agent, it's like, what the fuck? You know what I'm saying? Where the fuck is he going? What is he doing? Oh, it's a big decision. Blah, blah. Get out of here. I think he be knowing off GP where he going and what he doing. Uh, it's just to build suspense. You know, LeBron James, you know, he got agents. You know, he got managers. He got people giving him advice, telling him what to do. I don't really think he's exactly doing what he want to do, even though this move right here, trying to, you know, opt out. That's like some whole greed mess to me. Maybe he wants to get paid more money. I haven't been paying attention lately to LeBron's payroll. I know he gets paid a lot. Like, I think he's like the highest paid player now, I think, since Kobe has been gone. I think. I'm just, I'm not exactly sure. I haven't looked at this in a minute. But, I mean, right now he was going to make $21.5 this upcoming season. But he's opting out now. And they're talking about he's supposed to be getting a raise um i don't know man like i'm reading this little article right here that says and this is from cnbc and it says just like kevin kevin love lebron james is opting out of his contract with the cleveland cavaliers and will come will become a free agent on july 1st james had a player option worth 21.5 million for next season but according to cleveland.com james notified the cavaliers sunday that he is declining the option which is interesting right because Kevin Love is doing it too. So what's going on? Are they trying to build suspense like this team might not stay together? Are they trying to get more money? Are they setting up stuff so they can get rid of certain people? You know, what's going on? Is this just some fool around shit? Like, what's up, man? Cut Kevin Love opting out. Come on now. Like, you hurt. You ain't even finished the season. Fake injury. Injury, injury probably was fake and shit. Even though his injury to me, I think, did look worse than Kyrie's. Like, Kyrie's to me didn't look that bad. But I, Kevin Love looked like it could have hurt him. But then again, come on, let's think about it. It looked like it could have not neither, though. Seriously, let's be honest. This shit is weird as hell how these mugs just be getting hurt at, out of nowhere at these specific times. Just kind of like, kind of like reminding me about the Bulls a little bit. Like, remember back in the day when Bulls had good sign to try to get to the, you know, the finals? But it's, if mugs would be hurt, next thing you know, Noah hurt, Taj hurt, Kurt Heinrich hurt. It's like every five seconds somebody was getting hurt for BS. Oh, he's sick. Oh, he got hurt during training. Like, yeah, you really got to watch them when they say they get hurt during training. And they don't got no video footage or nothing. That's crazy. Then I heard somebody, I read one comment somewhere talking about Kyrie Irving playing ball, like, not too long after when he got so-called hurt. Which kind of got me thinking, too. Like, what's up with that? Like, what? Why? Like, y'all play a good amount of the season killing then all of a sudden magically y'all get hurt just like derrick rose y'all playing through a whole season you playing through a whole derrick rose didn't used to get hurt like that when he first started playing he used to play like all season all of a sudden when you get to the the end of the finals or not the finals but you know you get to the playoffs boom boom just craziness right but James, man, 
I don't know. This could just be a publicity stunt. This could just be for him to make some more money. Even though if he did come back, he would only be making $500,000 more, which is a lot of money. But to him, I don't think that's really a lot of money to him. You know, $500,000 compared, like, okay, wow, that's that big of a difference. He was just at 21.5. Like, that ain't much of a difference to me. Is it really worth opting out and doing all this? Like, is you trying to scare Cleveland fans? I bet you the Cleveland fans right now holding this dirt, <laughs> holding this new jersey. Like, ah, oh, shit, I knew we shouldn't have trusted him. I knew it. I knew we shouldn't have trusted him. He gonna come back. Use us for this money. Use us for this money and then leave I ass. Well, I don't know what's going to happen. He Okay, nine times out of ten, he probably will stay on Cleveland. All of them going to stay, man. Irvin, Love, more than likely they will. Nine times out of ten. Who knows, though? You never know. But, like, wouldn't it shock you if LeBron got on the Bulls? Now, that would shock you, wouldn't it? That would be some crazy... I mean, I know it was shocking when he got on the Heat, but that was only because Bosch came with him, too. Do you? I don't think it would have been that shocking if it was just James and, you know, Wade. Like, it would have still been a good team, but but Bosch added, added that extra thrill. You know, oh, let's send Bosch, too. You know what I'm saying? So, just something to think about. If that would trip you out if he got on the Bulls. Like, if he, if LeBron James got on the Bulls, that's a fact Bulls make it to the finals. The Bulls might take it all. But then again, I don't know how the Bulls is going to be this year, man. They got rid of Coach Tibbs, which I'm still very upset about. Like, y'all get rid of one of the best coaches I ever seen in my life. I ever seen. I cannot believe this. I just don't understand it. Coach Tills, man, man, he kept the Bulls in the playoffs, right? That'd be messed up if they don't even make the playoffs this year, even though they probably would. But that'd be messed up if they didn't, because they do have a new coach this year. But I just had to talk about this real quick. You know, I ain't going to take too much of y'all time. Just something to get y'all to think about. I'll definitely update this, I guess, when he's done and when this happens. You know, I'll give y'all an update what I think. Like, oh, was this just some whole controversy? And then it also says if he do come back and take the deal, it also says that next year he can do this again. They saying he can opt out again next year, which is just crazy if he do come back. So is this what the hell? So are they going to do this every year now? Every year? I'm not even excited about the draft. I know the draft was just not too long ago. I wasn't, wasn't excited. Not geeked. Not excited about the draft. It doesn't excite me. It excites me when I see y'all get on the court and y'all do something. Now, that's what's going to excite me. Right now, I, I don't... Come on, man. So, yeah, man. Follow me on Twitter. Add Miss Money AD. You know what I'm saying? Add me. Frame me on Snapchat. Miss Money AD. Like I said, man. Hit me up. Let me know what's good. Got some more topics. Gonna talk about some TV shows coming up, man. Review some TV shows right now. Sports is dead. Baseball is the only thing I'm watching right now, and I'm not talking about baseball. Nah. Uh, maybe, but football, basketball. So I'll holler at y'all later and stay up. Just something to think about. Because this is a little crazy.